It is Thursday morning, a few days before Christmas here in Eastern Kentucky, and it is a beautiful 45, 47 degree overcast kind of gray skies. And I'm in my hunting blind set up on the edge of a pond here on some private property doing a little waterfowl hunting. And I want to tell you about my morning, and there's definitely a ministry point to this story. So this morning I got up and and canoed across the, the pond and, and moved into my blind and, and set my decoys out. And there's a, a boy who lives on the property. He's about 10 years old. His name's Carson. And talked with him and his dad yesterday. And so uh, right before daylight, he hiked over from his house and joined me in my blind. And and uh, we sat for about two, two and a half hours just hanging out and talking and, and sharing stories. And I was asking all kinds of questions about school and, and his football season. And and the cool thing is we did have some birds come in and uh, Carson was able to take his very first duck, uh, which was really a cool experience. And then it kind of got got uh, slow and, and a little bit boring for him. And so he decided to hike back home. Um, this isn't the first time we've hunted together. And, and I've come out to the property and hung out with him and his family and, and, and Ron and I have, I've sat at the dinner table with him and his family. And usually when I come out, Rhonda sends baked goods for him and his sister. And just trying to build a relationship with this young boy and pour into him and, and mentor him and, and love on him and his sister and his family. But, but here's the point to all this. Yes, I have an office in my church building. But those four walls are not the boundaries of my office. They they cannot limit to what my office is. My office is where people are, where my church people are, where people that I love and want to minister to, and, and where people who have needs are and, and where strangers are. And so you need to make it a habit of getting outside of your office um, and do ministry. So today just happens to be my day off, but it's also... Uh, the calm before the storm. The next two days, they're telling us just stay at home. Don't even leave the house. It's going to be brutal. It's going to be bad. And so uh, today, being my day off, I made it a point to come out here and spend the morning with Carson and uh, just kind of pour into him. And that's the other point. Uh, not only is your office where the people are, that means it's relational ministry. And so, uh, you know, ministry is about two kinds of relationships, that, that very vital, important relationship between you and God or, or, or humans and God, and then those horizontal, be, you know, between human and human and, and brothers and sisters and, and all those relationships that form. And so I just want to encourage you to don't get stuck doing paperwork in your office, but make it a point to leave those four walls and go out and do relational ministry. I'm hoping some more birds fly here in a little while. Uh, if not, I'm going to go home and, and hang out with Rhonda. And tonight we have Christmas caroling with the church. And then I'll uh, hunker down before Christmas. And uh, Merry Christmas. Have a wonderful uh, Christmas. Whatever you're doing, whoever you're celebrating with, I love you. And uh, I'll see you next time.